What's smarter than AGI? This is my take on AGI and what it is. If you don't know me, I'm Harper. I'm an AI engineer with about 10 years of experience in the field. I got two degrees in computer science focused in AI at Stanford. I was at Meta for four years doing AI, and then I was founding engineer and head of AI at a startup acquired by NVIDIA. And now I teach AI so that everyone can understand it and use it to their benefit. First, what is AGI? Artificial General Intelligence. It's basically going to be an AI that has generalized intelligence, so it can learn new tasks, even though it hasn't done those tasks before and been trained on those tasks, and kind of operate through the world like a human, like generalized intelligence, like we have. Right now, the AI that we have is generally limited to what we train it to do, but AGI will be able to kind of just do anything kind of like a person. There has been a lot of obsession about AGI with OpenAI tirelessly racing towards achieving AGI. And there's so much obsession about it. When's it coming? What's gonna happen? But I think there's actually something that's smarter than AGI. And that is training specialized models, smaller models that are specialized for certain tasks. Racing towards AGI requires so much compute and so much data. It's so challenging to create and we're spending billions of dollars trying to achieve it. Yet to me, the magic of AI isn't about creating AI that kind of replaces humans or is equivalent to humans. To me, the real opportunity in AI is creating these specialized models for certain tasks. So for example, creating AI models that can predict cells that are cancer cells that can then transform into non-cancer cells for novel cancer treatments or diagnosing a disease years sooner than we could have before, or helping propel kids forward in school with specialized tech for their classes. Creating these small specialized models is available to us right now, and there are companies and institutions that are doing that. It's much easier to do. Basically, anyone can do it today. I actually made fine-tuning guides to help anyone fine-tune a model on their own data to create a model specialized for your use case. To me, that's the real magic of AI, is augmenting the human experience instead of replacing it.